Three points in front, six minutes remaining. Coleman's kick to the goal square. Hawkins takes off, outnumbered. Grant Hawkins handball to Wigney. Wigney snap across the face of goal from behind. So they're up to 13-11. They've had the last two scoring shots. They need a goal. They must kick a goal to win, I think, because we've got five and a half minutes remaining. I agree with you, Bruce. The next goal would just about win the game, I'd say. They've got to tighten up also, Footscray. They're a little bit loose. Collingwood fellows, and all credit to them, are continually running and finding space and not being tagged or picked up by their Footscray opponents as Christian is now on a break. Magpies don't want to surrender top spot. McGuan to the half-back line. Davies goes for the punch. Over the back, it's all Collingwood. Wham right. He goes to Turner. Will it sit for him? Yes, it does. Jamie Turner pulled off the ball just as he kicks it, but it's at half-forward. Foster racing after it. Tony Shaw, the short one to Bex. A goal coming up, I think, here to the Magpies. Bex is marked. 30 metres out, directly in front. Well, on that occasion, Foster went out to meet Shaw. Banks dropped back. Shaw won the ball. Chip over the head, finishes up with Banks, who is Foster's man. Dennis Banks, at times his kicking can be iffy. They want this. They'll be two points in front if he kicks this. Dennis Banks has goal. The Magpies have hit the front. The scoreboard. Collingwood, 12 19, 91, lead Footscray, 13 11, 89. Well, Footscray have made a real change here. Liberatore's gone off and he was injured. Royal is coming back on for them. And two points of difference. Now, Footscray have got to run in this occasion. They've got to lift in that centre bounce. Collingwood have been getting it away. What a game it's been. Collingwood trailing all day and they've hit the front with five minutes to go. Wine round his body. Hawkins attacks it with some power. Royal. Drop punt. Has it gone through? It bounces and misses. Oh! And they can't believe it. Well, that was a great effort by Windy. He had to do something. He did. He did it himself. Got it out. Royal. Hawkins combining. Yes, it was good by Scott Wine. That tap down. Mick McGuan. Someone on the lead. Who is it? It's Darren Mullane. Good play by Mullane. They've looked for him every day on a kick out. Mullane, they have. the centre wing, Banks and Foster, right mark to Dennis Banks. A vital passage of play coming up. And Four Foster. minutes of play left. Foster dragged the knees on that occasion across Banks' face. You'd know all about those tactics, Don. As we see Banks at half-back. Hand pass, McGuan. Collingwood get the next goal, I reckon their certainties. To half forward, punched away by Keenan Reynolds to the line. Will it sit? No, it won't. It beats Doug Barwick over the line. One point the margin, Collingwood lead, and we have three minutes and 40 seconds of play left in this game. Wind in the front spot. Kerrison, quick left foot. Hunter. Oh, desperate. Mark. Desperate. He's played well, Hunter. That should be 50 metres. Not given. Gives it over to Reynolds. Trying to set something up. Davies takes the mark. Kicked four goals early. Plays on. High ball. Wigney the target. Right. Oh, great mark. Well, he never took his eye off it. Came in from the side. Banks the target out wide. It's a good, strong kick. Banks uses his body. Now Turner. Still Turner. Breaks the tackle. Drop punt. Campbell in the front. McEwen at the back. Plays it like a defender, McEwen. Wine has to wait. Terry Wallace. Quickly to Atkins. Atkins wide to Cameron. Still a chance for Scrave. He's quick kick. Colin Hill. Will he take right on? Yes, he does. I thought he would. One bounce. Oh. Another bounce. Left foot. Look at this. A marvellous kick. He's put them in front. That's as good as you'll ever see. And Footscray are back in front. Well, 96 playing 91, and who would have expected this? What a great game. Colin Hook, who had a dirty third quarter, made a number of mistakes, taken off the ground at three-quarter time. He and the Hawkins were spoken to individually by the coach, Terry Wheeler. And what a splendid piece of play. And what a...
a sensational game. Brilliant play by Collinook. Great presence of mind. Great confidence to do it. Two minutes and 24 seconds of play left. Can the Magpies kick the next one? Can Footscray hold on? Richardson runs to 50. Has a shot at goal. Eppleston and Dacos. Tapped down by Eppleston and through for a point. Oh, the pressure in this game. It's like a final. What a great spectacle. Four points the margin. The time clock shows two minutes to go. Adrian Campbell, pressure on him. Oh, dangerous. Oh, no. He's gone short. Cameron inside. They've lost it. Great tackle, though. But why wouldn't you kick long at this stage of the game? Well, I suppose they are programmed to do it, but a little bit more experience would have been on on that occasion. Would have steadied down, or should have steadied down Cameron and kicked it long, as Peter McKenna just said. 96 to 92. Safety the boundary there by Wine and Hunter. <laughs> so a minute 35 remaining. It's been one of the classic contests, this. Collingwood picking themselves up from nowhere, and now Footscray respond. McGuan after Banks did very well. Monkhurst wants it. Banks throws it away. Kerrison. Still Kerrison. And Kerrison has just missed. Oh. Well, 12-21 to 14-12. And we've got a minute and eight seconds to go. And, and I'll, I'll, I'll bet you he'll go long. Like Campbell kicks long this time. He's a 60-metre kicker. He's wanting to go short. Look at him. Oh, no. Well, he's this time he does kick it long right out over the half-back line. Foster has it punched away. Free kick to Foster. He wrestled with Banks, and that's a vital free kick. A minute of play left. Can they hang on, Footscray? Can Collingwood snatch it as McGuinness kicks it long to centre wing? Wigney in the front spot. Gafer against him. Wigney does well. Kelly falls over. Right. They've got to do it here, Collingwood. Monkhurst is going to provide the lead. He kicks it to Monkhurst, but it's not a good kick. Wine takes Monkhurst on, and he should attack. Oh, oh goes short. Right, he had to kick it long. Now, right from the centre square with 30 seconds remaining. A ball to be won here, oh. and Foster wins it. What magnificent play by Stephen Wallace, because he chipped in in front of Barwick and shepherded him away from the ball. That is unselfish stuff, and well done by the former Bulldog skipper. Terry Wallace is where he'll kick it, long and wide. 12 seconds remaining. Oh, oh Mark. What a mark. They've won it. Well, they deserve to win it because they've been in front all day. It's 14-12 to 12-21, and the siren goes. Whatever you wanted an advertisement for our game, there it is. Footscray, 14, 12, 96. Their main contributor, Davies with four, Grant and Delray each three, and Collinook, two very good goals. 